Hello again everyone, I will be, addressing again the Gil Films drama, and I'll update what happened to the drama between Gil Films and the victim. This is a part 2 of the rant I made about the drama, if you want to, watch the first part, go watch it, in my previous video. So a few weeks ago, some people in Twitter made a comment that Gil Films hasn't responded to the drama. This is where I found out if he responded to the drama after his vacation or not. Gil Films said that he will be gone for a few days since he went on a vacation, which led to procrastination so that's why some people were now making comments about him not responding to the drama. What is procrastination you ask? Example, your mom told you to wash the dishes and you said that you'll be doing it tomorrow, but the next day you did something else instead of washing the dishes. That's how procrastination works and that's what Gil Films did. Here are the things that people said in X. Bell finally confessed and came out that all the informations, bad things about Gil Films and the drama were all fake. But even if the drama was all fake, that doesn't mean Gil Films can get away or the drama is over. She confessed and apologized but it made the drama more worse, and I think people are now doxing Bao instead. She probably left Twitter completely or made a new account after all the hate she got. Bao responded to the people using her voice instead of twitting her response to the drama. Now if you'll excuse me, I will be showing the voice audio right now so you guys won't have to go on Twitter and listen to what she said. Here it is. Um, second thing I saw Lego cried in his recent video, which I think is really crazy because it shows how he does like to guilt trip people. He obviously edited the video, he posted it there, and fixed it just a teeny bit later. He left that part in to make people feel bad for him. He's trying to victimize himself like every other time. He says things like, you know, oh my gosh, this, like I'm such a bad person or, you know, I'm a problem and he just like starts guilt tripping people by calling himself things and that's just what he does. The next thing is the doxing. I'm not responsible for that. And the reason why I haven't come out about it to say I think it's wrong is because, you know, people are still gonna attack me even if I say that. I don't think it's right. I do think it's wrong to, you know, send people's information around. But he's the one who got his information sent around. He's the reason. He sent his school to someone we barely knew, someone who was known for causing trouble in the community. Um, he trusted him or just carelessly sent his school. And like there, this person we knew was not trustworthy and they started sending, you know, they went through the school page, took his information, started sending it around. This was months ago. This is before any of this happened. To be honest, I did not like how Bao responded because she said that she was not responsible for the doxing thing, Gil Films makes himself a victim, and she also said that he is guilt tripping people which I think he'd never do. Like, girl you are literally responsible for the drama and doxing, you even framed him and summoned all of the people to come and dox Lego. Like, girl fix all of this, everyone already knows that you framed him and people doxed him before they don't know the whole truth. You even started the whole drama and exposing and now it's getting worse. I am so disappointed in you. Sorry about that. Even the others were jumping in conclusion right away even if they don't know all of the true information. Gil Films would never act like a victim also. He's an adult. Now he's not a baby anymore and he knows that victimizing yourself, guilt tripping, and being a bad person is not cool at all. He also regret everything he's done so we still don't know if he's going to respond after his vacation. Another worse part is that Bao even made some mean comment in the Twitter about Gil Films crying in his previous videos, which is the Roblox hunt, even though Bao was acting like the victim. He cut the video so no one will hear it again.
She said that she's not apologizing even if she started the drama. Bao, are you trying to victimize yourself instead? I can see it. Also, Bao said that she's 15 but a freshman in college? Isn't age 15 supposed to be in grade 9 or 10? I went to some research to find out who leaked his private informations and I found it. All of his private informations were leaked in an interview at his school. The person names Mason Send, his full name, cello career, address, and more. Gail Films wouldn't be careless and he would never show his private information to anyone. Mason sent the interview and private informations when the drama happened, many people were suggesting him not to show the video anymore. He said that he found the article audio from his interview at Gail Films' school. Maybe this is the guy that Bao was referring to, the guy that leaked the informations of Gale Films. I'd rather not show the interview video, because many people will watch it and it's already getting worse. This is what the people commented in the video. This is his response. But the link shows Gale Films dancing Gangnam Style instead to show that he disagrees with the people who told him to private that video. Please don't jump into conclusions right away because not all the things you see are real. Also, I changed my mind I'm not gonna side with Gale Films or Bao until the response of Gale Films is uploaded. Some people thought that Gale Films wasn't innocent, and some said that he was just because he got framed. But we need to see more of the evidence. I'll be updating the drama Ajin soon. Thank you for watching.